Number 2, given that tangent A is 2 over 3 and A is acute angle, so we know acute angle, find this one. So here, we know that when we have trigo, don't, don't forget the formula so, cha, toa. So we know that tangent is equal to, tangent is equal to O divided by A. O is opposite, A is adjacent. Adjacent is next to the angle. So if we have A, so if I just draw A here, this one is A. So tangent is actually equal to opposite divided by adjacent. And it's given that tangent A is equal to 2 over 3. So we know that O opposite to A here is 2 and adjacent to A here is 3. Okay, Find A sin A. So here we know that to find trigo. So we just find sin A first. <laughs> sin A is equal to from my formula sin A is equal to O divided by H where O is the opposite and H is the hypotenuse. So we need to know what is the hypotenuse. So this one is H. So we know Pythagoras theorem 2 square plus 3 square is equal to H square. So here H square is equal to 2 square is 4 and 3 square is 9 is equal to 13. So H is equal to 13. So here you get 13. So sin A is equal to opposite divided by hypotenuse. Opposite of A is 2 and hypotenuse is 13. B cos A. So cos square A alpha is actually equal to cos A square. It's the same with this one. So you need to find cos A. So cos alpha is equal to from my formula cos is equal to A divided by H or adjacent divided by hypotenuse. Adjacent ni betul-betul sebelah iaitu 3. Rightly uh, side of the angle but not the hypotenuse. So this one. So this one is A divided by H. So adjacent to this one is 3. Hypotenuse is equal to 13. So this one is cos A. So cos A square is equal to this one is equal to 3 over 13 square. So sorry I bring it down here. So 3 square divided by 13 Square, 3 square is 9. Set 13 square, square and square and set can be cut off. So you get 13. So this one is 9 over 13. So C, this one is a formula. Cotangent is equal to 1 over tangent alpha. So tangent, so we haven't found tangent yet. So tangent is given, right? Tangent is 2 over 3. So tangent is 2 over 3 means 1 over 2 over 3 or 3 over 2. Okay. You can just use a calculator. Okay lah, I'll just show you the manual one. So divide with fraction means times opposite. So 3 over 2. Okay, so this one done, this one done, this one done. So the cosecant. So we know cosecant A is equal to 1 over sine. Alpha. So cosecant is equal to 1 over sine. Cotangent is equal to 1 over tangent. Secant is equal to 1 over cos. So you see here this one C is opposite. So do we have sine? Yes, we have sine A before. Sine A we calculate as 2 over 13, right? So this one is equal to 1 over 2 over set 13. So we get set 13 over 2. So this one is set 13 over 2. So here secant A to substitute we need to know what is our secant. So we know that secant alpha is equal to 1 over cos. 1 over cos alpha. So we have calculate in B. Before we calculate cos square alpha, we need to find cos alpha first, right? So our cos alpha is, so this one should be, so you just reverse set 13. Okay, so this one, 
secant is equal to 1 over cos. So, 1 over cos is 3 over set 13. So, you are supposed to get set 13 over 3. So, this one is your secant. Okay, so now you have to substitute. So, 4 minus, so secant square alpha divided by 2 minus secant alpha. So, here you can directly substitute secant inside here. So, or there is another easier way. You see here, this one is 4. 4 is actually 2 square minus secant square alpha divided by 2 minus secant alpha. So, this one you see here, you can factorize, right? So, we have here up here a square minus b square is equal to a minus b, a plus b. So, here you get 2 minus secant alpha. 2 plus secant alpha, alpha divided by 2 minus secant alpha. So, this one, this one can be cut off. So, you get 2 plus secant alpha which is equal to 2 plus. So, our secant just now is, where did I, okay, this one, so 13 over 3. So, you just use your calculator and you are supposed to get. So, this one is 6 over 3 plus 13 over 3. So, 6 plus 13 over 3. If you see from your textbook solution, so here you will get 23 divided by 3, 6 minus 13. So, if you key in in your calculator, it will give you 6 plus 13 over 3 which is actually same with this one. So, this one and this one is the same one. So, yeah.